Then we put you through a, a real file review on those scenarios. And the file review process is part of the training. And if you successfully kind of get your brain wrapped around be, having corrections sent to you and, and, and properly sending those corrections back to us, um, then we will pass you. And then that person, that senior vice president, takes that person to you, if it's you, and walks down to HR and says, slaps it on the lead HR person's desk and says, fast track this person to the front of the uh, the line of new people that we have. So the next time that they have uh, a deployment where they can send new people, which is hurricanes, I'm telling you, this is a great way to get to the front of the line with this. Certifications. Again, I will point to um, Fast Track to Deployment, which is our certification. Um, it is a uh, framework for handling claims that kind of cuts away all the baloney and just focuses on, hey, you've got, you've been handed claims. Here's how you manage them from the very second you show up. They give the, you these claims to the to the very last phone call that you have with the homeowner. We teach you that whole process and we test you on it. Right, this is why it's a certification. It's not a certificate of completion. You can't just like pay the money and then just get like you know a thing saying, "Hey, I, I bought Matt's course." It's not how it works. Um, when we test you, there's a 50 question multiple choice test on all the materials to make sure that it's, it's in there, right? So that we're we're confident that it's some of it at least stuck, right? And then the other the other half of the test is a practical section where you do three. Uh, claim scenarios on your own property, your own house, your own apartment. If you don't have your own house or apartment, friends, house or apartment. I've had somebody do a Starbucks before um, to do the because all we're really after is all this stuff that we taught you. Are you able to put it into practice? Then we put you through a, a real file review on those scenarios. And the file review process is part of the training. And if you successfully kind of get your brain wrapped around be, having corrections sent to you and, and, and properly sending those corrections back to us, um, then we will pass you. And we'll send, I'll send uh, notes to um, my people. And this is not HR people. This is v, VPs. This is um, senior executives at these companies that I'm friends with, that I know, that I've developed relationships with. And I say, hey, I have another fast track grad. Here's what their scores were. Here's the states where they're licensed. Um, they're ready to go work. They did. Here's a, a, basically some comments about how they took did the class. Here's the things that they need to work on. So if you if you kind of like just half ass it on there, there's, that section might be a little bit bigger. You know, this person seems to have some potential, um, and but struggled in these these areas. They struggled in doing corrections. Um, so this may be something where you you know when you get them onto your roster that you, they need to have some resources put to them, right? There you go. And then that person, that senior vice president, takes that person to you, if it's you, and walks down to HR and says, slaps it on the lead HR person's desk and says, fast track this person to the front of the uh, the line of new people that we have. So the next time that they have uh, a deployment where they can send new people, which is hurricanes, I'm telling you, this is a great way to get to the front of the line with this. Um, then you get that's where you get put, right? You still have to, if you haven't already, you still have to onboard, you still have to get licenses. They may say, hey, listen, you know, we really can't do a whole lot with you until you get like these seven licenses, right? Go get those licenses, right? Hey, we're not going to put you to work. We don't care where you went to school. Um, we love Matt's program. We love Guy Grant's program. We love, uh, you know, MoCat, Calvin's program, um, so on and so forth. But we're not going to put you, this is pilot, for example. We're not putting you to work unless you come and do a five-day or a 10-day claims college assessment, whatever it is. Go do those things. You have to go do those things, which is why if you haven't onboarded, if you're like, well, I'm going to wait till I get this license or I get this training or get this, forget about that. It doesn't matter. You can have your name written on a, on a like a cocktail napkin and that's your resume right just matt here i am and you can apply at all these firms and they're going to get you into the system they're going to do the background checks they're going to do some of them do a credit check whiz quiz so on and so forth right a whole bunch of like dumb stuff that you got to do this time consuming right you don't want to be doing that when they when the storm is making landfall right you want to do that now and then you you when you get your fast track to deployment thing, they, they'll look you up in the computer, right? When I certify you, this VP will 
look you up in the computer and be like, okay, this person's already on our list. It looks like they got a bunch of licenses. Great. Now I can skip them ahead and just put them into this thing because we, we don't, they don't need all this remedial stuff that they were going to have, they were going to have to do if they didn't have any other training. Right. Um, so that fast tracks you even better. So the biggest piece of key advice after getting licenses is to, is to, uh, as soon as you get off this call, after you get some more licenses, apply to all these firms right now. And if you go to adjustertv.com slash certify, I have a list of the firms that are our partners, current partners. Um, but I've heard that some other part, uh, other firms are honoring our, our certification as well. That's a certification, right? So that gives you, um, claims process training and it, it's because it's the entire process, it is field for field and remote desk, right? So you're going to do the whole thing. Um, you may if doing it as a field adjuster. You may only do photo and scope, right? You may just be running around with your phone. You're not doing anything with tape measure or whatever, um, which is fine for that one company, right? And you do that deployment for six weeks and then starting to wrap up and your manager calls you and says, Hey, Pete, uh, listen, I, it looks like you got, a, you got like three pending left. Are you, you going to be done with those in the next few days? Oh, yeah, I'm going to be done with those today. Well, listen, uh, I got this opportunity for State Farm or, or for Allstate or for Liberty or somebody, whoever it is, right? Um, three states over the other way. It's Big Hailstorm. You want to go. And you're like, oh, yeah, sure. And when you get there, you're not just doing photo and scope stuff on your phone, right, with the app. You're not doing any of that. You're doing the full meal deal. They may even have you write checks, right? This program teaches you how to do that. Conversely, uh, as a desk adjuster, you're going to learn, have an understanding of the field process, how that looks, how it's supposed to look when a good adjuster is doing what they're supposed to be doing. Give you a little bit of practice with it so that you can speak intelligently when you do, if you do do file review on somebody or your claims examiner or whatever. And then it gives you the other half of it, which is writing the estimates, made it, making it absolutely fantastic bulletproof, crystal clear file that will sail through file review and get you paid faster, right? So that's that's that program in a nutshell. And then the cherry on top, obviously, is that you get access to my professional network where I personally hand you off once you graduate and you've proven that this is sticking with you, or that it's, you got it, right? Um, other certifications I recommend, level two, you're going to hear people on social media say, well, exact me level two, I mean, Eh, it's not really worth anything. They're just trying to take your money because you know it's exact where, and they're like they're the evil empire or whatever. You don't need it. You know, I firms don't care about it. Partially true, right? Um, a lot of I firms don't care about it. A lot of carriers don't care about it, um, which is okay, right? Some do. Some care about it a lot, right? Some say there's there are several carriers that say, hey, we're not putting an IA to work unless they have a level two, like a real level two. They've taken the test and you can sh they can show me their certificate of, you know, passing the test and what the score is and everything. Cause you do, you get a score when you pass that test. Um, so some do care, right? So why limit yourself? Number one, number two, um, which I think totally defeats this whole, like, well, nobody really cares about it. If you go through that and you test your, like go through the, the training, which is, we've got exact domain certification prep in adjuster TV plus here. Um, go through that, that prep training and then take the test and you prove it to yourself, right? I can, uh, under a little bit of pressure of being in an exam, I can look at something that's not just something I made up or that's giving me the instructions on how to do it. Like in the training part, there's a picture, a diagram of a house. I have to recreate that in exact domain, build an estimate and then answer like questions and be within 1%, right? Of whatever the answer is. Um, there's something about that. That's, a uh, you know, for you, even if you nobody ever knew that you got level two certified, you know that you're level two certified, and that and you know that with the level two in particular, there's, with the exception of like really, really, really flexing that software with large water claims or or total loss fire or something like that, the stuff that you learn in level two is way more than that you than you need to do fence claims or water spot on the ceiling or a few shingles blown off like the vast majority of claims that you're going to get on a hurricane right or a hailstorm right if you, if you can go through level one um if it's all you got time to do is just like crack open adjuster tv plus and just follow the level one trainings um and do the exercises and everything that are in there and, and, and make sure that you understand each part before you go to the next video. It's a great foundation for Xactimate and it's 
it's going to get you 98% of the way there, I think. I, I, people poo-poo level one saying, well, it's not worth the, you know, any the paper that's written on or whatever. I don't believe that. Having taught it um, and having gone through you know, the level one training and having built the trainings my own for level one, it, I mean, it's what I, if we were in the truck and driving around and I was mentoring you and like teaching you how to do this stuff as we went, I would teach you just, it would be level one, right? Because you wouldn't need the rest of that stuff to get those claims closed. So um, fast track, Xactimate training, uh, Symbility now has uh, a level one and two, I think. They may have a three now. Uh, you guys can correct me if I'm wrong on that. Uh, but I know that they had released up to a level two recently. Um, also worth it. If Xactimate is still like, has the lion's share of, uh, claims and like carriers that are using it, but Symbility picked up, um, you know, Liberty Mutual Safeco, which is, you know, they're a top, th at least a top 10 carrier, or their major carrier. So that's, if you, if you can get proficient in, in Symbility, um, then you're going to be, you know, open up more opportunities for yourself. And if they do call you and say, Hey, you know, go, we want you to go do this Liberty Mutual storm. And you've been doing, you know, whoever else, USAA, and you're doing Xactimate over here, you don't have to like learn Symbility on the fly because you said, well, yeah, sure, I'll totally do that. Do you know Symbility? Yeah, I, 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 I can figure it out. Yeah, no, it's, yeah, no, I've, yeah, I've messed around with it. Yeah, okay, sure. Yeah, yeah, no, it's gonna be yeah, totally fine. And then you're like trying to go figure out a Symbility. Learn it now, right? Um, at least learn how to do the claims workflow with it. Again, we've got Symbility training in Adjuster TV Plus for you. You've already got access to that. Um, so I would say, to start, those would be the main ones that I would do. Um, for more advanced stuff, especially if you want to do daily claims, I would pick up the IICRC um, designation, um, or at least take the prep for it for the water, or is it water restoration technician? Um, there's really only like one or two things in the, the IICRC that I think adjusters would, would benefit from. Um, Hague has a lot of really great stuff. Um, and I've got discounts for their stuff as well. Anything that that I have place that I have a discount with, the discount code is Adjust Your TV. Um, so it makes it easy for you guys. It's not like Adjust Your TV 100 or Matt 609 or whatever it is. It's just straight up Adjust Your TV. But Hague, um, their um, Hague certified reviewer program is pretty good. Um, it covers Xactimate and Stability together, as well as construction and sort of like desk claims sort of a desk claims focus. Um, they're, I think they're shining like, you know, sort of signature stuff though is going to be like their rough stuff, like their materials stuff. So the Hague Certified Inspector, which you have to to um, show that you've got, have, have been on at least a hundred roofs in some capacity, whether you're like working on them or you're doing like photo and scope or something like that. But once you get that, then that's, it's a, it's a certification that is, um, it carries some weight, plus it gives you a lot of really great knowledge. So Hague Certified Inspector, Fast Track, um, and Xactimate Level 1 and 2, and Symbility Level 2. Um, it's a great start for you. For a hurricane, you know, you don't have a lot of time to take a gazillion different certifications. Again, it's not really, you don't, we don't really have resumes per se in, in claims, at least on the independent side. It's really more a matter of um, can you do the job, right? And these, though, all those certifications are going to help you do the job. They will help you get work. They they will distinguish two identical resumes, and yours has a f three or four of those certifications on it. Yours is going to be picked up first before this guy. Okay, so that's you know. But if you're the same, I mean, it's you know, it's a it's a it's a coin toss. Get access to my professional network as a fast track certified grad, and let's get your career started. Not in ninety days. Not in six months, but right now. To learn more and get signed up, visit adjustertv.com slash certify.